Not so much. You cook something in the microwave, what happens? You don't put a towel or you don't put a cover over it and splatters everywhere. And you should probably do this every now and again anyways, but I have a nice trick for you that doesn't take a lot of elbow grease. Take you some wet paper towels and we're gonna put them in some water. What I like to do is just put them in there, get them nice and wet. And I also do a little deodorizing at the same time. Put a little lemon juice on it. Put them in your microwave about three to five minutes, let's say. Put them in there, zap them when you're done. Let it cool down till you're able to touch them, probably two, three minutes. But the steam from the paper towels gets all the gunk loosened up. The lemon juice makes it smell good. Then you just use your paper towels, wipe it all out, and you're good to go. Let's also talk about after you've done all your dishes. The hardest part for me is when you're putting your dishes on the counter to dry and you go back the next day to put them away and they're still wet. I have a couple tricks for you for that. Say you dry your, uh, you wash your wine glasses. You don't want them sitting on your towel because they're not going to get dry on the inside. Take you some chopsticks. The flat ones work the best, but we have round ones here today, but it's not going to matter because you have your towel. After you've done washing, washing, you can line up your wine glasses on there. That way you have a little vent in there to get the water all gone. So you come back tomorrow, they'll be nice and dry. Well, that's going to do it for us today. Thanks for joining us for Time and Sense. We'll see you next time.